Okay, let's go. Leonard Mountain Homestead coming at you with another video. <laughs> this one's going to be a little different. Um, the Vineyard Chicks, the Bushcraft Family, and Lazy Days Ahead with Jesse and Lisa have put on this awesome collaboration. It is Survival Seeds 2024. Um, I'm going to show you this. Is that cool? They sent me this little envelope and this little guide to show me about everything that they sent all the seeds um, and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about um, the seeds that they sent me and they're they're packaged so cute sorry I'm outside because it's a beautiful day I'm outside doing this video and you'll hear my rooster so when you hear that say hey big red <laughs> he hears me that's why that's why he's he's making noise but look at these awesome little packets. Isn't that cute? They did a wonderful job. I'm just saying. And I'm, I'm very, very happy to be part of this collaboration. I will tell you right now, I have not had a, um, a garden with a lot of stuff. My mother-in-law has. Um, Chris grew some peppers in his garden last year and so I've already planted some seeds um, I haven't planted these yet but I plan to so thank you for putting on this collaboration to the Vineyard Chicks Bushcraft Family and Jesse and Lisa at Lazy Days Ahead um, I'm not in any particular order I'm not going to read off the pamphlet I'm just going to let you know what's in each of these little um, packets. Um, the first one is the light red kidney bean. I've never planted that before, but I'm going to give it a try. And then we have, um, oh, I'm going to have to check because this one doesn't have the little tomatoes. It's okay. It is okay. I just noted that, that noticed that, um, there's no little seeds in here or maybe there is, there is, I'm sorry. I was wrong. There is. Um, it's the, t uh, the Mariana tomato. I hope I'm saying that right, Vineyard Chicks. Um, and then I have the Detroit Red Beet. I've not planted that one either. Um, so these are all new for me because, like I said, I've not planted anything inside a um, garden before. I've tried, and it's, it's not come it's not come out. It's not been a good day. Now, now that we live on the homestead, we're going to try and, and plant some stuff. Um, so thank you again. And then we have the Walla Walla Onion. I love that name. I love it. It's so cool. Um, and it, they gave, they gave um, information on how to, to plant it, what each seed needs. That's awesome. Thank you because that's very helpful. Um, the Italian Pepperoncini Pepper. I hope I didn't kill that name. I'm just reading it off. <laughs> um, I was saying that I was going to leave all of the peppers to Chris because, like I said, last year he had um, his pepper garden. And um, so I'm leaving all the peppers to him to grow. Um, and then the last one is the Waltham Butternut Squash. Again, very cute. They, like I said, each of the packets have the information on them, and um, so does the pamphlet. So I, I just, th I think that's just, that is so cute. That is the cutest little, um, cutest little things. Um, so I will, I will do another video um, after I plant them, and. Um, let y'all know how it's going. Um, I do have some growth already on the ones that I've already planted um, that I did on my seeding video, my planting video. So 
I look forward to seeing how this does. Um, like I said, I've not had any of this stuff in um, a garden. I've never had a garden. Like I said, my mother-in-law has a big garden. But Chris is making me a little area that I can plant my seeds and stuff. So thank you again to um, the Vineyard Chicks, the Bush Craft Family, and Lazy Days Ahead with Jesse and Lisa. I'm going to read this. I'm going to do what I can to hopefully get some of this planted and have some growth. So it's all a learning thing for me. Um, and if I have any questions, I will definitely email y'all um, to ask some questions because like, I'm new at this. I'm, I'm very new at this, but I, I'm very interested in doing this because like I said, on my homestead, I want to have something that I could have to make my family, to grow it my own. Stuff in the, the, the market is very, very expensive. And so if I can do something on the homestead that um, I can grow and myself, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it and I'm going to bring you all along. So... Thank you again. I'm going to keep saying that. Um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for allowing me to be part of this. I'm very excited. So stay tuned for another video with me either planting or um, showing how they grow. Uh, hopefully I have my garden area ready to plant these. So yeah. Okay. That's my video for today. I know it wasn't very long, but it's just saying um, the little package that I received from the Survival Seed Collaboration 2024. I'm very happy to be part of it. Hopefully I can grow some stuff. <laughs> Love you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share because... This is what we're about. Growing stuff, being more sufficient on this homestead, getting more animals. You know, it's just awesome. So, look forward to 